Hey, it's Renelle. Welcome to my channel. Well, I started doing this thing every Sunday where I do a weekly reset routine. I've like perfected it to the point where I'm like, this is the ultimate self-care slash weekly routine for anybody who is like me, who's a go, go, go kind of person, but knows that if they don't take some time off, sometimes they will burn out. It's like the perfect mix of productivity and resting so that you can have that relaxing day off but also feel like you did something. Without further ado, let's get into it. The first thing I start with is my morning routine. My morning routine is the same every single day, like that doesn't change. So this is what we do first before we do anything else. Cause baby love Next order of business is the first productive thing of the day, and that is to do laundry, and that includes your bedding. I actually like doing this once a week. I don't know about you, but like every time I wait too long to do this, I end up getting to the end of the night and like my stuff isn't dry, and then I have to like use like a makeshift sheet or whatever. And like when it comes to my bed, like I'm very particular about it. I like it to be made a certain way, it needs to be made at all times. So when I get to the end of the day and that is not the way it is, it just really bothers me. So we're gonna do that right now so we can get that out of the way and then we have a bunch of clean clothes and clean bedding to start the week. Can't wait for the long day. Cause baby like ooh, it's all another flower lay. The sun goes around the stay. Okay, so obviously this is pretty full. So we're probably gonna have to do two loads. I usually put these in separate anyway because they take up most of the wash. Okay, so while the laundry's in, we're gonna continue to be productive by cleaning our room and cleaning our space, cleaning our bathroom, the kitchen, whatever you need to clean. I'm gonna focus on my room today and the bathroom. I'm already a pretty organized person. Like, I don't really like clutter and I like don't like having stuff everywhere and being a mess. But every week I like to like literally wipe down the surfaces, clean the bathroom, like Windex mirrors, vacuum, all that kind of stuff. It just makes my room and my space feel so much more refreshed. And I don't know, I love a nice like clean, space so we're gonna do that while the laundry's in the laundry's done make our bed all nice and then it'll complete the room Can't wait for the long day. In the sun when I, I found you the one you call you got what I So room is clean, last little laundry is in. The only thing that's not done in my room is my bed, which I will make when the laundry is done. I spray this in my room every time I clean it. It makes it smell amazing every single time. The next thing on the list is usually to do my everything shower, have an everything shower. If you have not had one of those before, I'm gonna put you on. It is literally the best thing for self care. But I decided, I had this impulse to go for a run. So I'm gonna listen to that and go for a run and then have the shower when I come back. I like to do some sort of movement on these days off because if it's like a lazy day, I will go crazy if I don't move my body. So usually I'll just do like a walk or something like just gentle like that. So we're gonna do that first and then we'll come back and have an everything shower. I'm sure it's freezing outside, so I'm gonna have to bundle up, but it's fine. It's now time for an everything shower. We are going to shave, we're gonna wash our hair, we're gonna do a hair mask, we're gonna exfoliate, we're gonna use our sugar cookie body wash, all the things to make me feel like a luxurious queen, and then I can use my favorite body butter after that. I'm super looking forward to this because this has gotten to a point where like I just can't even, like it's so puffy. I put a lot of product in it when I went out on Friday just so it would stay curly, and then when I do that, it's like you can't go back and now it's not gonna go down. Not enough water in the world can make this just, you know. Three piece lineup today for skincare. I've got a double cleanser, an exfoliant, and our day cream.
I had some extra time last week, so I already planned out this week in my bullet journal. That's what I use to keep track of what I need to remember and like things I have to do. It allows me to be creative. I used to use a planner from Chapters that I absolutely love, but I wanted to track some things and I wanted to have more creativity. Well, every like month, it's a different theme. So for January, we are going for like a digital theme. So my planner for the week was supposed to look kind of like digitally. So I'll just show you. I kind of block out like what's on it because like that's confidential. If I hadn't done that already, I would have been doing that now. But I was ahead of the game. I actually planned out the last week of January too. Wow, I had some a lot of free time on my hands. Anyway, realizing that I did not write my to-do list, so I guess we can do that now because <laughs> that would be a good thing to get done. And I've been waiting so long The time for you has come I want to show The rain has been around for way too long Cause baby like ooh, ooh. so nice about crawling under your freshly clean sheets and blankets in your freshly clean pajamas. So nice. Now I'm gonna watch my show. I'm gonna watch him with him. Time to go to sleep now. Thank you so much for spending the day with me. See you in my next video. Chat soon. Bye.